off with the colors They kinda tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are And the way we lose it There's something different about us And the reason why we stay So we may have just done something for both of our older girls um, Abby, we're at Costco, if you can't tell. Very minimal shopping, because that's what we wanted. Um, Abby is coming this afternoon to buy herself a pair of AirPods. She asked me yesterday, can you take me, can you pick me up? We have a busy schedule tonight, which we'll talk about in a minute. So we went to price them to make sure that that's what, you know, the price I told her yesterday, and make sure she has the money for it, if she does. And all of a sudden, Jason's like, no, I'm gonna get this one on her. I'm gonna buy it for her, right? I said, if you're buying that, you need to buy the senior a gift. She needs a graduation. And so we've been texting both of them, trying to figure out what style they want. Let's go outside where it's not so noisy. In the meantime, this is what we got. I'll tell you about that cake here in a second. And then we got bananas, cucumbers, lots of fruit and veggies. We're really trying hard today. I didn't mean just today. Like we're not just trying to eat good today. We're trying to shop good today. Snarky. All right. So in the process of trying to figure out what style of AirPods Abby wanted and Kaylee wanted because we're buying both of them a pair, I was trying to be conspicuous and asking Abby, hey, we're at Costco. Just wanting to find out the price of these for you. What style did you like? But she didn't get back to me. So then I had to ask Kaylee. Kaylee's not buying any. He doesn't have money to buy any. <laughs> and so she's like, why are you asking? And I was like, because I can't remember which one of you wanted pros. I think one of you did and blah, blah, blah. So I kept going back and forth and Kaylee was getting so confused and she wasn't really giving me the answer I wanted for either one of them. And finally, like, finally got her to like, she's like, no, we would both like this kind, the original kind. And I was like, oh, get the okay, good. Cause they have those kind here for Abby. <laughs> What she doesn't know is that she is, in fact, getting a regular pair as well and just doesn't know about it. Those girls are wrapped around Dad's little finger. But she deserves it for graduation and Abby deserves it for all of her hard work and the hard struggle she's had physically and mentally over the past couple years. And she's willing to pay for them herself, um, like I said. But it's just our way of saying, you don't need to. Let us get it. Let us take that you so we are gonna pick her up in about two hours so we'll drop this food off at home wrap up that present and we'll pick her up at school acting like we're gonna come here to Costco and then deviate and get it out of the glove box or something cute something cute and then she's probably gonna want a cinnamon roll so we'll get her a cinnamon roll and just tell her we're happy with her and all that she's done so and then tonight oh, I haven't even said um, tonight, Ashley has her year-end performance for her cheer squad at the Seattle Storm game. And it's a huge event. Um, professional team, kind of a, that's cool. It's she a professional team, and it's a big performance. It also means because she has now officially, now that you guys know, she has officially joined the competitive squad. Um, well, I haven't signed her up yet because the new session doesn't start. We're ending this current one. And my budget needs to wait before I pay for the next squad fees. Um, she has officially joined the competitive squad and she has to start fundraising. And one of the fundraisers tonight at the game is a raffle, um, ticket raffles. And our team will get 50% of the raffle ticket funds. So. The more she does, the more money they can get. Niho <laughs> Niko. Exactly. Now we can tell you all this stuff. Um, I can tell you. I can yeah, put we it. Can in, just, in we can it. just say it in Japanese, and then they had to figure it out. No. Um, I'm going to insert the clip from um, just a few days ago of her and I talking after talking to the coach and kind of what we talked about. So I'm going to insert that here, and then we're going to go home and. Um, get all this food taken care of and then go get Abby but also I signed Ashley up for stunt and tumble camp this summer it's like a four or five day camp all day and her coach was like I need her to do that camp like I really need her to do that this summer um, to it get her ready like, I really need you to pay for it then. I know <laughs> but it they actually start to, we weren't supposed to go this way home 
and I need a beverage. I need a beverage. The light's out right here because they're doing construction. But anyway, um, it's going to be great practice because they start to learn the competitive dances. The ones that you saw in the video the other day um, and what you might see from tonight, she's ha can't learn and perform um, all of the dances quite yet because unfortunately we didn't show this part of the other night, the friends and family night. Um, but when they're on the competitive team and they do the stunts and, um, and tumbling and all that kind of stuff, their squad is very distinct and like everyone is in their positions and everyone has to come to every practice and they can only practice if everyone is there because everyone is, you know, the pyramid only works if everyone is there. Um, and I guess a few weeks ago they had someone on the team ghost them and has never come back. I know, but they... I'd be worried about the kid. Well, yeah. I mean, I think they've tried to find out, like, what's wrong or why did they leave or whatever. But, like, it meant that half of the squad couldn't perform because they don't have that one person that has learned the entire routine. So, un unfortunately, for Friends and Family Night, half the quad squad had to sit out and Ashley hasn't quite learned it yet. So, she's not a part of it yet herself. And again, for tonight's performance, half the squad won't be able to perform either. Oh, really? Yeah, because they don't have a full squad. They don't have that that one person that knew the whole routine is missing. And she was a bigger girl. Like, she was so like... what is Ashley going to get to do? Well, she'll get to perform everything else, just like she did the other night. But, um, and she's not fully up to steam on performing everything with that stunt squad anyway. So, anyway. Flashback to a few days ago, Ashley and I were talking about the after that performance talking to the coach and then we'll be back with you but we went up and talked to the coach afterward about the competitive squad and she is in fact desperately wanting Ashley to do the competitive squad but also tonight she told us that Ashley was nominated three times for the MBT the most valued team player yeah. um, but it was and she's that, like yeah. she was literally nominated by many people wanting her to win MV MVT. But also, what did she tell you about your, um, about the competitive team? I would, I will be going to Japan if I join. She's like, she needs to join the competitive team. She needs to do the cheer and camp this summer and she will go to Japan in April. Which <laughs> we gotta save up for and figure out um, which is crazy. You're gonna have to do the fundraisers with them, right? Yeah. Luckily, they do fundraisers to help them earn the money. And then when I told her that her dad speaks Japanese and I'm the cheer mom and I wanna go, and she was like, your husband speaks Japanese? Yes, he's coming. <laughs> she was like, he is coming. And I was like, oh, he needs to freshen up. It's been a long time. And she's like, Duolingo, my friend, Duolingo. He needs to really get caught up on it. We're gonna call it a night with you guys. It's been an eventful day. Very excited for all these fun yet really expensive things that we're doing this year and next year. So take care, you guys. Keep watching because we need to earn all the money possible. Right, I'm Ashley? I'm going to Hawaii. No, I'm gonna make Hawaii happen. <laughs> Just might be in February versus April because I don't know if we can do Hawaii and Japan at the same time. Even Abby, you don't know this, but Abby was like, well, I wanna go to Japan. I'm willing to miss school to go to Japan. If she earns her ticket, she might be able to get to go with us. We'll see how it goes. Chelsea okay. wants to go too. Does she? Yeah. I mean, like, Abby's Abby. like, why can't we all go? <laughs> it's a lot. All right. I just wanna talk to you before we go. Thank you. She has got her laptop, so we look for that. Oh, she already has a freaking laptop. Are you My kidding me? I was actually thinking about that. I was like, it would be a lot of work to transfer all my crap to a new oh, one. So I'm like, eh. Make sure you do a backup somewhere. If you need to drive to do it, we can no. do it. Yeah. Anyway, did you, you did you get you. catch on, or did, is that a surprise? Oh, I was too tired to realize. Good. That's <laughs> what my hope was. <laughs> and I was Abby, 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 Abby. So hopefully you didn't. Oh, I don't get your messages. No, like to you, like I need to know for Abby. I need to know for Abby. Oh. So, but that is in fact the one you wanted, yes. right? That one, yeah. We'll take it upstairs with you. They're yours. Okay. Congrats on graduating.
A little, it's yeah. a little something early. That's, yeah, that's next week. Yeah. Crazy. For days. Four, five. five. Six. Because we're just over a week. Uh, just under a week. Yeah. So we weren't anticipating giving it to Kaylee right when we did, but literally our whole evening is stacked from this point on. And she probably won't be home when we get home or we're gonna have to rush out. I didn't want to rush the situation. And I wanted her to be alone when she got them versus when everyone else is home from school. And it was totally unexpected, which is great. Um, but we are on our way to go get Abby. She thinks we're rushing off to Costco, um, but we're not. And we're at, I told Kaylee, I was like, we're gonna be in a hurry. We won't get home before Ashley gets home. We're gonna be home before Ashley gets home because we don't actually have to go to Costco. So I have everyone fooled so far. Um, Abby, we're not gonna tell her until we're not heading to Costco. And then she'll be like, wait, go to Costco. Should we just like pull over at that point? Sure. And give it to her? Okay. We just passed Ashley's school and we've had excellent weather. Excellent weather. And of course today is field day. And it's raining and has been most of the day. It's cloudy, overcast, miserable, normal, to be fair, northwest weather before we get out of summer break. But today of all days is field day. So they're out on the field and they're pouring rain and their hoodies and the teachers are standing under umbrellas and raincoats. Miserable. And they probably have popsicles and ice cream cones and that's gonna make them even more cold but looks like the kids were out there having a good time. They're pretty used to it. This was an odd year to have such good weather leading up to field day. So I think that's what was, you know, harder that knowing we had the chance of having it on a better day, so. All right, we just got Abby. We're trying to figure out how to get over to Costco. She's right, she always knows how to sit right behind me so you can't see her. <laughs> so, Abby. Yeah. We went to Costco for you. Oh, you got it? Yep, we did. Thought we were going to get them right now. Well, we're getting it for you. We got it for you. You've been working so hard. Thank you. You, you work you hard didn't at need school, to pay for that. you work hard at work. I mean, all you girls are great, but we just want to say thank you to you, you know? Yeah, thank you. You're welcome. Are those the right ones you like? Yeah, they're good. Yeah, because I struggled between you and Kaylee. <laughs> Kaylee did get a pair Kaylee herself. Uh oh, Kaylee. But you two did not make it easy to figure out what pair what you pair, guys wanted. What piece you guys wanted. Kaylee's like oh. the small one. And I was like, <laughs> I don't understand why you made the small one. Because she didn't want mine. Yeah. My, the ones that I got back from Hawaii. And I was like, what? You have been hard at work and had a good yeah. and bad year. and. We just wanted to tell you that we see your hard work and effort and thank you. Love you, we're proud of you. Yeah. Okay, we're headed to your very last performance, right? Yes. We are fighting rain and traffic and heading over to Seattle. This um, peak rush hour. Peak rush hour. Uh, yeah, it's, it's, gonna, it's a little stressful on time. We are late, we had to backtrack and get it back out of line to get on the highway and come back road um, to find another on-ramp that isn't as busy, um, but we are gonna make it in time. We really only need to make it in time to sell raffle tickets. And then an hour later, her practice starts. And then an hour after that, the game starts. So we have a little wiggle room. Yeah, it's a long, <laughs> it'll be a long night. Um, but I'm excited People to ask me like and the other power squad members like why are you so tired like It's only like a 40 minute class and we're like, <laughs> You aren't there for 40 minutes. You're pretty dedicated to it kiddo Yeah, your head itch from the, sun, the yeah, hairspray I'm trying to play with my hair. No, don't play with that. It messes with the bow Don't mess with it You said it was the last time But you keep coming back to tell me Sorry that you take back All the things you said just to hurt me I love just went cold But I'm still burning I love just went cold 
just went cold. Why? I keep on making the same mistake. I always let you back in when I begin to get myself together again. You are back once more, like everything's the same. I tried to build my world. Well, that was insane. We did the 50-50 raffle, and Ashley earned her team $245 plus a $1 tip. <laughs> she sold so many raffle tickets, she did so good. Her confidence level was like up here. I'm just so proud of her. She did a really good she job. Really good. So now she's with her coaches for a little bit while the game starts. We're going to our seats, and then they're gonna go practice, and then they're gonna perform. Never got it, what you have to go? I guess this world's too slow for you. I think there's beauty in the gray, the cold, but you just want the gold. And there's no way I can beat it, cause I got no chance, no chance when it comes to her. She got the glitter and the fame. This wasn't enough for you
Good job, kiddo. I'm proud of you. I know. I know. Really? I don't. Wait, I didn't even see you. Come on. Let's get wow. in. Well, I, there's a reason why everyone said the storm game is the funnest one. And the, despite the fact that she's exhausted today, go, go <laughs> or right back. now, oh, um, that was incredible. Right, Jay? That was super fun. Yeah, it makes me want to bring the girls next time, like get everyone tickets. Next and our staff, like I want everyone to come next year. <laughs> and then I would get a basketball sign. Yeah. Oh, yeah, if you sell a bunch. Yeah, the top ticket sales um, won a signed basketball and something else yeah anyway pretty fun i've never come to this arena i've only come to this fountain once with patty and her husband when we came with them and then there's the space needle pretty cool when I was coming, I heard ashley that. was like can i go down the slide <laughs> and i was like yeah why not it's pretty cool we just got her picture in front of the space needle too because when else are you going to get a picture of you in the cheerleader outfit next year next year <laughs> look at that determination girl Good job. Okay, you go up the ladder all the way. <laughs> it's pretty high up there, kiddo. <laughs> and then you gotta do the catwalk across. There you go. Okay, go. I think I'll lay down. Ow, oh, that feels like skin. <laughs> you okay? Isn't no, it's not. So this is where Kaylee had prom. This is called Mopop. It's right here by the Space Needle. Um, it's pretty cool in there. Maybe sometime we should go in there. All right. Well, this girl earned herself some Wendy's because the Chick Fil A is temporarily closed. There, they must be doing some remodeling or moving or something. We tried again. Um, but we are going to sign off tonight. It's been a very long day, but a very cool day. Lots of fun things going on. So stay tuned for next time, and we'll see you guys later. Graduation is coming up very, very soon. So stay tuned. Kaylee is leaving the nest. <laughs> or at least in... in <laughs> she's, stay, she's not. She's, she's staying home. <laughs> <laughs> She's gonna move moot office Our for, channel for a little bit a longer. Lot bigger for her to leave the nest. <laughs> exactly. She's staying home, <laughs> but she feels like she's. Oh, there's a bunny. Don't bunny go. Oh, that's a little oh right bunny. down. It's a oh little goodness bunny. sakes. Still gotta learn not to get run okay, over. Okay. Good night, guys. <laughs>